saw. He underestimated me and thought I was too dumb to figure it out. <laughs> Looks like Surkov's in for a surprise. Then you have the upper hand. I don't think anyone knows what happened in the mansion, and Surkov's already under the radar. Might be a little too early for congratulations. I still need to get Surkov. Got a fix on where he's hiding yet? In doing the background check? I run a batch file to track any connections or equity Surkov has in local companies. Especially dummy corporations. One rose to the top. Molotech. Hmm. It's local, and it's been shut down for months. Why Molotech? Because the batch file also checks key cards, cell phone, and internet activity. And all of those have been detected at Molotech in the past 24 hours. And, according to the timestamps, not long after you paid Surkov a visit in his office. Then we've got a job to do. I'm heading out. Careful, Mike. I don't know if Surkov's expecting you, but... I'll be careful. I promise I won't blow up anything or shoot anyone unless I have to. <laughs> nice. Alright, let's upgrade this. Oh, come on. Only four? Damn. Alright, I'll wait for it then. Everything's going into the pistols. Sabotage can wait. Well, I wonder if I have enough money for a new pistol. Hey Mike, hope things are more interesting in your neck of the woods. Still chasing the news here. No matter where it goes, found a nice cafe, the Charming Gardens, where the food isn't too bad. I'll send you some pictures. Had an interview there with some local government officials. Mostly a stand and nod smiling event. While they discussed Taiwanese relations with China. Scarlet. Mike Thornton. Patricia, we made 914 short sales over six months against 17 competitors. Each time we shorted, we whipped up some quickie corps to, and made the trades on their name. Each time we short sold, we made sure we weren't actually borrowing someone else's shares. We were naked shorting the stocks. This drove down the share prices of the 17 competitor corporations as the flood of sale orders sent the signal that someone was trying to offload the stocks. When it was time to settle the shorts, we stalled and eventually folded the dumby corporations that made the purchase, not before moving the proceeds to or of the short sale to the offshore holding. Estimated losses to the competition, three companies folded outright beyond our optimistic goals, five more suffered direct directorial forced retirement due to shareholder uproar, only four have rallied since. I'll have my assistant write you up a more detailed score sheet. Score sheet? Wow. <laughs> Estimated losses on our end. We'll need to throw 12 people under the bus as the feds from seven different countries are going to need to pin the sales and dummy corpse on someone. I can send you a list of expendables. Brad Stoffenhauer. Interesting. So, we can send it to the black market. I've got some intel I need to move, evidence of Halbeck marketing manipulation in the European markets via naked short sailing. Put it up for auction and send me my share. I can send it to Halbeck, Mr. Stoffenherr. I came across a most fascinating set of facts regarding your naked short sailing. Selling. What a delightful name. It'll make great headline news. Now, I'm not an unreasonable man. Just send me your personal cut of the profits, payable to my Swiss bank account, you know how it works, and I'll make sure nobody hears about your business plan. Nah. Hi, Scarlet. Naked, short <laughs> Naked shorting has less to do with midgets and more to do with finances. Wow. Boring. 
That said, found some internal memos about Halbeck's marketing manipulation in Europe. Do me a favor and make this network news, M. Thornton. Ah, you can have it. Ah, she likes me. Mina Tang. You're not much of a casual flirtation kind of guy, are you? I obviously like you. You're a good agent, and I like being able to whisper in your ear while you shoot bullets, or while people shoot bullets at you. I'm also cooped up in this facility with zero chance to actually have a social life, so you could imagine how months inside the gray box turns just about anyone a little eager for interaction. That said, I can't go anywhere anytime soon, so let's not get ahead of ourselves. Besides, you have a lot of work to do, and I need to be your objective assistant. We need to keep up our rela we need to keep our relationship focused and efficient. For the time being at least. If you don't screw everything up, and the world is still in one piece, you can buy me dinner, and we'll see what happens. Mina. Mina Tang, DV server. I know you worked at the facility for all of like five minutes before your first mission, but did you ever get login credentials for a DV server? I'm guessing not, but I figured I'd ask. I thought I knew every server, and terminal in this facility, but I overheard Parker muttering something to Westridge about sifting around the DV server. Mina. Let's see. I can be snarky. Yes, I did. Username M. Thornton. Password MILF lover. Um, no. <laughs> I'm not familiar with that server. Look into it and let me know if any if it yields anything interesting. Cordial. Hi, Mina. During my very brief stay at the facility, I was provided with login credentials for the Hemera and Iberus, uh servers only. Sorry, I can't be of more help. Good luck eavesdropping on your employer's top secret data networks. Uh, we'll be cordial. I'll archive that. Let's see. Can I buy what I want? It's the uh, written grouper. Ah, there it is. Ritter grouper. Ritter groupin razor. Yes. Um. Let's see. What were the other ones? I can do that one. A commissar apparently. Um. I can do that one, which nah. And I can do this one. Um. What's the difference? Well, that would get me plus two and plus three on that. That's less bullets. Negative one recoil. But the accuracy and the stability are amazing. I think I'll buy that. Yes. But I can't just yet. Hmm. Oh, well. I wonder if I have enough by selling some stuff. I don't want this. Really don't want that. Um, this will get me more accuracy and less stability. Hmm. I think I might actually put that on my uh, pistol. Yeah. Anything here to sell? Indeed there is. Something here. Uh, nothing there. Lots of stuff here. I'm definitely going to use that. I don't need the night operations armor anymore. Flash bob will be nice. Recoil with all weapons. Strike damage. I don't care about strike damage, but I like these two. Those two are good. All right, let's uh, put some stuff on. That one. That one. And I want to check out, I think it's this, yes, oops, can I, uh-huh, why is it, that's weird, okay, better, ah, perfect, now is there anything here, let's just uh, make sure, 
I don't think I saw anything the last time I was looking, but I was just curious. Alright. Get rid of uh, whatever else I have left. Nothing there. Get rid of this. Good. And uh, that's about it. I have to wait a little bit longer until I can uh, get the cash for the pistol that I want, which is not too far out of my range. It's a little bit further. Um, let's see here. I definitely want to get some more of this. No, no, no. Ah, I think I'm good to go. Cool. About intel. Bonus objective added to confront Sirkov mission. A well-placed bribe will yield a tip on targets of opportunity you might find in Sirkov's business. Hmm. Prevent Sirkov's escape using uh, surveillance stuff. Hmm. I don't need a map. And a dossier on Sirkov's men. I'll take that. Well, I need to get about uh, 25,000 more before I can get that pistol. But for the moment, I'm good to go.